Hello everyone and welcome to a new Infinity Kingdom video. This is Kinkade from 49 and in this video guys I want to talk more in details about Infernal Assault, how we do it and what is the most efficient way to do it to obtain more gold and save troops as much as possible as you can see here. Let me just delete this uh, mark here. Uh, we're doing a level 30 camps uh, this is uh, critical's turn here we take turns to kill the core we do it clockwise it's just the three of us beaver nuts critical and me i'm using a special marsh to maintain my losses i make sure that i kill the first <laughs> Cam, this is kind of cheating, but I make sure that I kill the first cam just to make sure that whenever they kill these, I get gold as you can see here. So I don't mess on anything when it comes to killing the cams. I get almost 125,000 whenever a cam is being killed. For seven cams around the core, and then the core itself provide a lot of gold, especially even if. It wasn't me who killed it. I think this is my turn to kill the core. The last one was critical. Yeah, this is my turn. And as you can see guys, the losses I'm getting is very minimum. It is 200 maximum. Again, I'm the first to kill the first camp. So I'm not gonna miss out on any gold. Uh, the reason I'm using this marsh, I, I am sure that I've explained this uh, before. I'm using a fire marsh because they have a crazy amount of energy regain. Let me just... We just finished a kill event in the server and I'm already out of troops. Uh, mainly it's Hippo and Hippolyta who finished the fights. As you can see, Hippolyta here just casted one scale of Flaming Smite. Hippolyta didn't, uh, Empress Wu didn't even get to cast her skill. Just a couple, just one cast of Death Breath and then one cast of Chase. That was enough to finish the fight. Oh, I missed, I missed few camps here. Uh, whose turn is this? This is uh, this is critical turn. Okay, I gotta clear this. And if you take a look at Hippolyta's energy regain here, you'll be able to see it is 117 energy regain even without war talents. I'm using farm talents at the moment. Same for Empress Wu, 117 energy regain. This is a crazy amount of energy regain compared to my water march. I think Dido has the highest energy regain in my water march, which is 113. Even though I'm using an artifact that provides 20% energy regain increase. This is why I'm using a fire march to finish the fights faster. So I won't receive any damage from the lightning chips on the... On the camps itself, if you take a look here, I received zero damage from the ship because the fight finished in less than 14 seconds. And I keep mentioning this, I mentioned this in most of the previous videos I talked about the camps or how to save more troops fighting weak camps or weak gnome units using such marches. I, I think I started with 20 million gold. We have been running this for almost 30 minutes and I've got over 36 million gold 
in less than 30 minutes and we'll keep doing this until i run out of ep or until i get the gold i need i think i need almost 200 million gold in order to finish few immortals that i'm working on such as hannibal i need to upgrade him to boost 20 and maybe elizabeth i need to upgrade her to boost 20 so this is all for this video guys i hope i explained a bit more for the infernal salt camps thank you so much guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video mm -hmm.